My name's Tim Bonfield. I'm a senior recovery worker with the Norfolk Integrated Housing Community Support Service, also known as the NICS team. A senior recovery worker is someone who works in the community. Uh, we work with people in their homes, on the streets. We work with people in a community setting. Our role is probably with the most intense people to work with. It's not pretty. As I say, we're dealing with a lot of drug use. Um, play people's homes that are not in a good state. They have really lead very chaotic lifestyles often. You have to just be non, non judgmental. Our main aim is really to try and keep a roof over someone's head, but it's, it's all about building up a, a relationship and a, a bit of trust um, with our clients so that hopefully when a situation does arise, they feel confident enough to come to us and we, we can sort that out. Part of my job role is to be able to work flexibly and from pretty much anywhere, often working from cafes, from a park bench, from my car, from home. We try and aim to see around five hours one-to-one -one support in the day, um, but that can vary. Each one of our days can be a very fluid thing, so you could get to your first visit and there could be a, an emergency situation which puts the rest of the day on hold. We're lucky that we have a team that, if we have to, we can call up and say, can our other people cover a, a visit while we, we deal with an emergency situation. My original background was working in pubs and clubs. I got to an age where I, f I felt like I needed something more. I moved on to work in a residential setting, and that was for adults with learning difficulties. And then I moved on from there to working for Norwich Mind in their outreach service, so which is a very similar role to what I do now. I went from there to working for the Knicks team. The pub work set me up to do this role. It, it teaches you to talk to people who aren't necessarily in the right place and you see people from every walk of life. Part of our role is, is working with people who are really difficult to engage with or in worst case scenario a crisis situation. We have to work quickly um, and liaise with lots of professionals, social workers, hospitals, CGL which is the drug and alcohol specialist in Norwich. We have to adapt quickly and react quickly to try and get that person the help they need. We also have to be quite forward with how we work and we have to step in and, and be quite firm with what that person needs um, and get other professionals involved and press home the importance of that. Someone who's in crisis may not even want the help that you're trying to, to give. We often will say that actually a lot of the time when someone's disengaging from us, that is the time they need the support the most. We work in a way that can help people in a, in a practical way. Ultimately, we are standing up for people who we see um, and we're being their voice. If you're a, a compassionate and caring person, naturally, you know, you probably do have the skills to be able to work in this sector. Life experience in this role counts for a lot. I don't think I ever thought I would necessarily be in this role looking back at my life when I was a lot younger, but I really enjoy what I do and I don't see myself anywhere else.